What a day to forget my bikini. Oh no, <laughs> we planned a whole beach day together, Marina Valmont and I, and she forgot her bikini. <laughs> um, here, I'll move over a little so that you can okay. have more. Thank Space. you. You're welcome. I, I don't know, I thought it was in my bag. Then I thought it was in my car, and none of it was true. Well, since we each have like 30 bikinis, we should leave one in our car each, just in case of a spontaneous beach day. That's true. Not that this one was spontaneous, but it could have been. Could have been. I it mean, my, my, really could have been. my legs are getting tanned, but my stomach could be getting tanned. Aww. Luckily, you're already pretty tan, so it will not be a total fail. <laughs> True, and legs are the hardest part of the body to tan, I find. Last time I came to the beach, um, I went topless. Did you? At a public beach, yes. Huh, I was thinking about that, but I didn't want to cause public upset. I know, sometimes you have to weigh the risks. Mm. But I talked about that in my on, on the YouTube channel and okay. um, on TikTok. And you know what? It's going viral on TikTok. Really? Yeah, me talking about my beach day and what I chose to do. And people are all like, yes, do it. We support it. We love it. Because it's legal here. Mm -hmm. But it's not legal in a lot of places. So a lot of people are like, whoa, it's legal there? That's crazy. Um, yeah, it is here. The only thing that stops me is uh, negative reaction from people. Like people getting upset about it. I know. You're I'm like, I don't want to deal with negative vibes. I just want to be topless and fancy free since i've done it a lot like over the years um mm -hmm. i've noticed that the reactions are more positive than you might think usually there's a lot of like people that just kind of look mm -hmm. at you and laugh a little bit <laughs> like they just kind of like Haha, you know um yeah. yeah especially if you're not close to anybody mm -hmm. um because if they really like the worst thing that happens is usually just someone gives you a mean luck or something but okay have yeah. you ever had anyone try and take a picture Ooh, probably. Like a sneaky so, picture. This was, this happened a few weeks ago. Um, I was wearing a top this time. I was wearing, I was wearing a full bikini, but this is a story of what happened to me at the beach. I was with my friend, um, a female friend, and um, this guy came up to us, and he was like pretty obviously a tourist, but he was like- <laughs> Also hitting on you? He was like, he came up and he was like, can I take a photo with you? <laughs> like. Not because and, he knew you or no, just... No, no, no. He didn't know who I was, I don't think. So, I was just there as like a civilian, like regular mm. civilian beach day. Like, I'm not trying to be like a celebrity you or anything. just wanted a picture with a pretty girl. Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. So, I, I said no because I didn't want to like create a lot of attention to me. Mm. And also like a lot of times people like use that as like an entrance to hang out with you for the rest of the mm. day. So, I was like no. But anyways. He, did, he was like, he then went on to be like, oh, but I'm so sad. Like, I, I feel so sad that you don't want to take a picture with me. And he tried to like make me feel sad for him. I was like, but that I don't feel sad work. for you right now. Like we're all at the beach, just have a good beach day by yourself. Yeah. But then you don't need this picture. Upon further rejection, he went and belly flopped in the water, <laughs> swam away. Oh my gosh. How old was this guy? I don't probably, I don't know, could have been my age. Like okay. he wasn't old, he was kind of young, but weird he had an epic rejection that day and he mm. swam away and he was not to be seen for the rest of the day <laughs> mom i hope he appeared later that day on shore somewhere maybe he probably yeah. fl washed up on shore somewhere down the lake <laughs> <laughs> hoping you would be there to take a photo with him so yeah <laughs> you know i love taking photos mm. Of my own self of my own accord but yeah. i don't like to um you know i wouldn't be a very good celebrity because like if the paparazzi came around i'd be like no <laughs> i think if i was at an event i would take photos absolutely or if someone said hey i know you from naked news can i take a socially distant photo yes yeah but i've had some people wanting to take photos in the past and they end up grabbing your ass i know or like squeezing you and it's like that's, that's for a photo, true. not a feel. That's true. That was one of the other reasons. That's one of the mm. reasons why I say no, unless it's unless it's a naked news event. Because yeah. then, you then know, we're safe. We're I friends. do like take photos with people at events. But yeah, whenever I'm like at, as a civilian, I always say no because people will grab your butt 
unconsensually. Mm -hmm. And they'll think like, oh, whatever, you're you're naked for a living. It's fine. It's not fine. Yeah. There's no consent. Being naked is not consent. Looking and touching is like really mm -hmm. different. Yeah. Looking is good. But yeah, it was funny seeing the comments on the TikTok because people were like, oh, mm. like, I wish people would do this more. And and then somebody said something like, yeah, like, if like looking mm. or they said something like, oh, we want to look, but, as long, but hopefully you don't get catcalled. And then I was like, <laughs> yeah, like respectful, like looking at mm. us when we're topless is cool with us. We just don't like mm. people catcalling us. Yeah, the cat calling. And if people like respected the topless ladies more at the beach and in general, we would do it more. So it would like be a win-win situation. I would love to be topless right now, and I've got my my thong on underneath. So I think I'm on par with what you're wearing back there. Yeah. <laughs> Butts out for days. <laughs> Butts out for the summer. Butts out for the summer. So I think you've spurred me to uh, eventually today go topless. You know, now that we're talking about it so much, um. I think like I might do it a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> so you just lay here, go a little topless, I don't know. Yeah, as long as you're like, you know, not causing a scene. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, I think so. And then we're gonna have a dinner date later. So we're gonna have a great day. I'm, I'm gonna go. really looking forward to that. I'm already hungry. Oh. Oh, I just had a sushi roll. One, just in preparation. Yeah, it's good to warm up for dinner. Mm -hmm. Well, guys, thanks for coming to Beach Talks with Alana <laughs> and Marina. <laughs> Not to be confused with TED Talks, but Beach almost. Talks. Almost. Almost. <laughs> um, <sighs> enjoy this luscious, sunny day, um, as we will. And um, I will walk away. Goodbye, Marines. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.